In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect microphone to BandLab on PC. So the first thing you want to do, you want to take your microphone and you want to plug it into your computer. So once you've done that using a USB port or any different port you may have, the first thing you then want to do is you want to go down here at the bottom at the taskbar of your Windows computer. And then you want to hover over this sound or speakers bar over here. So this icon and you want to right click on it and you want to click on sound settings. Now, Inside sound settings, you want to go to input over here and you want to make sure that for input, you have your microphone selected. So for me, I have this Yeti stereo microphone over here and I have it selected. And as you can see over here, you can even ch change the volume and put it to however much you want it to be. So for me, I usually keep it at around 70, which I found is kind of the best area. But of course, depending on which microphone you may have, this will differ and you can play around with it and see what's the best. So once you've actually done this, you can just double check, check to be sure you can do right click again click on open volume mixer and then make sure under input device there's the uh, microphone you want to use so if both of these are working well then we can proceed on to band lab so you want to go to bandlab.com to the website and you want to sign into your account and then you want to create a new project or of course you can just go with a project you may already have and then over here it's going to give you a bunch of options. Now, if you want to record, you will have to press this button over here. And to do this, you press this and you'll see that uh, at the beginning, you'll get this pop up over here, the top left, which will look like this. And it's going to show you microphone and then automatically blocked. So you want to enable this microphone and you want to then click on this arrow over here and then you can click on allow on every visit. OK, so once you've done that, you're pretty much set and then you can just reload this site. And then, of course, when you're inside your project, you can then just start recording and everything is going to work perfectly for yourself. OK, so as I said, this and then uh, I mean, set in the settings and you're good. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.